Okay. Now, every time we watch TV, we have to log in. Now, does everybody know their code numbers? Three. Two. Four. One. Wrong. <laughs> Twelve. <laughs> Wrong again. Kate, if you make me guess every number there is, we could be here for hours. Uh, that's not the point. I think what Kate is trying to say... I know what Kate is trying to say. I'm an alien, not a foreigner. <laughs> okay, I can't have a number? Give me a letter. N-O. That's two letters. Let me just try to understand, Alf. The operative word in people log is people. One of which you are not one. That's cruel. Not to mention poorly constructed from a grammatical standpoint. Al, we just don't think that the ratings people are interested in viewers from outer space. In other words, the operative word in Thompson family is family. One of which I am not part of. This one. You're one of the family, Al. Oh, sure. Like Arnold Schwarzenegger's one of the Kennedys. <laughs> Why can't Alf have a number? He watches TV all the time. And the man did say that everyone who watches should log in. See? They're on my side. You know, Willie, maybe Alf should have a number. I mean, we do have a responsibility to give them all the data as accurately as possible. Yeah, and I love pushing these little silver buttons. <laughs> maps of developing nations. Why aren't we watching the Love Connection? We're waiting for the McNeil Lara report. Well, la de da I thought the popcorn popper was broken. It is. I popped this with your curling iron. I won't ask how you melted the butter. Hot comb. You know, I thought the whole point of this ratings hoo-ha was to find out what people really watch. Well, we really watch McNeil and Lehrer. Oh, yeah? Describe them to me. Well, they wear neckties, and they speak in well-modulated voices. Yo, tennis! It's me, Trevor! Speaking of well-modulated voices. Um, just, just a minute, Trevor. Alf, go into the kitchen. Go into the kitchen. Go into the kitchen. As a woman, you should be sensitive to the demeaning undertones in that remark. Now! You're betraying your sisters. <laughs> hey, Willie, really, how's it going? Oh. Hi, Kate. Hi, I was... Hey. Is this one of those box things that lets you steal cable? No. Well, of course it's not. No, we've been asked to become one of those TV ratings families. No kidding. No. Well, it figures. You got your two adults. You got your two kids. You got your cat. You got your average height. <laughs> You're the prototypical American family. Too bad this rating stuff's a crock. Well, why do you say that? Because the best programs always come in last. Now, case in point. Poker Jamboree. It's like a Slavic soul train. Here, dig. <laughs> right now, we wanted to check out the uh, rainfall in Sri Lanka. Going on a picnic? <laughs> Trevor. Uh, was there something you wanted? Oh, yeah. Could you turn on our sprinklers while we're gone? Raquel and I are taking a trip to the Big Apple. Oh, <laughs> New York. No, Washington State. Some farmer up there grew an 80-pound golden delicious. <laughs> <laughs> well, sure, we'll be happy to water the yard. Trevor, where's the control? I don't have one. I just hook up my hose to your spigot. Well, I should have no problem, man. <laughs> I never do. <laughs> See you in a month. Jamboree! Turn on Polka Jamboree! Oh, why would you want to watch Polka Jamboree? 
They're playing cat barrel polka. That's beer barrel polka, I believe. They put beer in barrels? Well, they take the cats out first. Makes sense.